information about uh, bunker, how we are going to do the bunker calculation and uh, what are all the things that we need to take into consideration when we are going to do the bunker calculation. So usually what happens is when you take bunker, you have to keep uh, the ship's condition in mind. So try to inform duty officer to keep vessel always in upright, that is zero trim and no list. So that uh, you will get exact quantity how much we took bunker from the shore. So that is the idea to keep uh, the vessel uh, upright all time for the entire bunker operation. So that you don't get confused, you don't need to do more calculation to get how much uh, amount of uh, fuel we received on board. So one is trim, how much is the trim we need to know and the other thing is list. What is the degree of list and where is the list, whether it is port side, uh, starboard side, all this thing you need to know if in case the vessel is having all these conditions. So before uh, uh, taking into account all these things, we need to know how we do the bunker calculation and for that uh, we need to do the sounding or allege for knowing the exact amount of quantity inside the tank. So what is uh, allege and what is sounding? So it is very simple. Eh? Suppose uh, uh, say this is a tank, this is a tank and this tank is filled with this much of oil. So this is your uh, sounding pipe, sounding pipe and this is your tank. So this is your sounding tape. So if I drop the sounding tape from here till the bottom of the tank, that is called as sounding. From here to here, you call it as sounding. And if I drop the sounding tape till the oil level, only till here, this you call it as allege. So these are the difference between sounding and allege. So the idea of taking allege is first thing you don't need to keep the sounding tape till the entire tank, till the end of the tank. You can uh, get your uh, sounding tape damaged or dirty. So to avoid the Whenever you take bunker, you do allege. So initially, for uh, initial stage of bunker, we take full sounding. When the oil keeps coming up, then you start doing the allege. So this is the difference between allege and sounding. Okay. Uh, next, for taking the calculation, for doing the calculation, suppose uh, in my I took uh, sixty percent oil in my tank, I get some n number of sounding. So how do I know the value? How much is the quantity inside the tank? That is why you have a sounding table, sounding book on board ship. Whether it is for a ballast tank or beer tank, you'll be having individual sounding table and sounding uh, book. So this is the sounding book. Eh? So how to read the sounding book so first thing say i am going to take for number two fuel oil tank port side you can see this is the trim correction table eh? this is the trim correction table and you can see the allege in meter and centimeter and if it is trim is by head 1.0 meter 0.5 meter you will get this reading and by stern 0.51 1.52 you will get this rating. So you have to do the correction based on this trim correction table for this particular tank. And next is second condition is list. This is the list correction table for the same tank number two fuel oil tank port side. So again same allege centimeter everything will be given here and if it is list to port 0.5 degree 1 degree whatever 
that the correction value will be here and list to starboard same correction value will be here so these are the two things that we need to do before taking the uh, exact uh, sounding value like how much uh, oil we have in the tank that we can decide only after doing the trim correction and heel correction means uh, list correction and then okay next we come to the capacity table so uh, yeah so this is what you call it as capacity table so again same for number 2 fuel oil tank port side so how to read this book huh? first you see the allage gauge so you can see the allage value centimeter meter and this is centimeter and next will be the capacity for 2 meter uh, 2 meter this much will be the value meter cube inside the tank and next is kg this is lcg and it this three need, you don't need to take into account because this is for uh, vessel stress purpose so this is your uh, longitudinal center of gravity and this is your inertia and this is kg so this three thing you don't need to uh, take in mind only we need to consideration is this capacity sounding and according to the sounding you have to do the list correction and trim correction so i'll do one correction for this so suppose uh, i get a value of 2.10 so okay i get the allage value 2.10 centimeter and for the same the quantity is 256.11 so I take into account vessel trim is 0 0.5 degree by uh, port side uh, by stern I take by stern uh, and uh, list again 0 0.5 degree by port so these are the two condition that i need to do before concluding this value okay so i do the trim correction first so for 2.10 centimeter the value is 256.111 meter cube i said the trim correction trim is 0 0.5 by stern and list is 0 0.5 by port so first we go for 0 0.5 trim correction so 2.10 centimeter is equal to 2.10 into 100 that is 2100 mm okay 2100 mm so now i have to go for trim correction trim trim correction that is 0 0.5 so I go to the trim correction table you can see here yeah? I said 0 0.5 by stone so 0 0.5 meter by stone my reading is 2.10 so I go between this 2.5 0 and 2.50 but the value is same for all that is 1 1 mm so that means 2.2100 mm this is plus i have to add 1 mm that is 2101 mm that is equal to 2.101 centimeter so trim correction is done eh? trim correction so now i have to go for 0 0.5 degree by port list so 2.101 centimeter that is equal to 2.101 mm i do the list correction so here you can see a eh? list to port list to port 0.5 degree 0.5 degree 
you can see a 0.5 degree list to port uh, my sounding is 2.10 so between this two 2.50 and 2 are same minus 68 minus 68 so what I need to do is 2101 mm minus 68 mm so what you get is 2101 minus 68 that is 20 2033 mm that means 2.03 centimeter so now for my when I took the sounding tape it give me 2.10 after I did the trim correction and list correction the sounding is 2.03 centimeter and I have to go for the value 2.03 centimeter is 258.17 258.17 meter cube that's all eh? very simple so you can see eh? when the value of uh, when the quantity for 2.10 is 256.11 meter cube eh? and after doing the trim correction and uh, list correction you found the value is increased by around 2 tons you can see eh? the value for 2.10 centimeter is 256.11 meter cube after trim and uh, list correction you get the sounding is 2.03 centimeter and the value is 258.17 meter cube so the difference you can see here eh? almost 258.17 minus 256.11 that is 2.06 meter cube difference is there so uh, this is the reason that uh, we need to do trim correction and uh, port correct, uh, list correction whenever you are taking the sounding because if the quantity is less the difference may be very less if you are not uh, considering the trim and uh, list but if you are going for uh, biggest, bigger uh, quantity of bunker this small trim also will give you a big difference in quantity so to avoid any uh, like kind of misunderstanding you better do the trim correction and uh, list correction for uh, taking for doing bunker calculation so i believe uh, this video must have given you some information about uh, how to do bunker calculation with respect to trim and list uh, correction if you have any doubt definitely you can put in comment box or uh, you can whatsapp me and reply you thanks for watching